So we've already settled space. Uh, we've been living in space permanently for the last 17 and a half years. And now it's just a matter of where do we go next? And where's the next lily pad in the pond? So where's next? Obviously enough, it's the moon. It's only three days away. And there's still a whole bunch of stuff that we need to invent and figure out before we can safely go as far as Mars or beyond. There's water on the moon, deep in the, in the craters at the North Pole and the South Pole. And if you've got water, then you've got hydrogen and oxygen, which is fuel, oxygen to breathe, water to drink. You just need an energy source. And we can get solar power at the poles. So, so I think the moon will be next. It'll start really small with little unmanned rovers. And I, think, I think if you look at the history of Antarctica, that's been not a bad predictor of, of what the moon's gonna look like for the next 25, 50 years. If, if you look at Antarctica, 100 years ago, we could just barely get there. People died all the time. Now, thousands of people live in Antarctica from all around the world. And as a result of living there, we understand the Earth's atmosphere, the ozone layer, the health of the planet, the history of the planet the cosmic background explorer to understand the origins of the universe itself. We've learned all that by, by having people and researchers down in Antarctica. If you want to inspire people, you need to have a big crazy idea. When Kennedy in the early 60s said, we are gonna put a man on the moon and bring him back safely by the end of the decade, it was nuts, it was crazy. And so when Elon says, we're going to Mars, it's not like we're going to Mars tomorrow. But that's the goal. That's the long-term goal. And so there's a lot of steps between here and getting to Mars. But if you don't give yourself Mars as a goal, then you're not going to take those steps. So I think it's smart and logical of Elon to stand up and say, you know where we're really going? Mars. In the meanwhile, we've got to do all these other things. But that's where we're going. And that's what his people are working towards. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.